Hey up ducks, I'm Dorian Gay, and welcome to SteamWorld Day. Oh. Well, I don't reckon I'll get out of here the way I got in. Could be part of my uncle's mind, I guess. All it needs is a splash of paint. Better explore it before the rest of my light dwindles. Oh dear, Rusty, what have you got yourself into here? Say, what do you think you're doing? Your dramatic entrance just caved the roof in. Oh dear. I'm sorry, miss. My uncle sent me here to claim to claim this mine. I was heading to Tumbleton to find out why when I fell through. Oh, you're Joe's nephew. He's been gone a while. I've been sneaking down here mining what little I can, and I just found him. I'm sorry. You should go see for yourself. This does not sound good, does it? All right. There we go. Oh dear. Oh dearie me. Poor Uncle Joe. It's been a while, Uncle. Sorry I didn't make it here before you left us. You always claim we were so much alike. Can't say I understand why you sent me the claim, though. I'm no miner. Well, I hate to rob you of your plunder. If I could just borrow your pickaxe, I might get out of this calaboose. Calaboose? Is that a word? Okay, let's get us out of here. Dig, dig, dig. Ouch. Yes, there is fall damage in this game. You can slide down a few things to actually save yourself a bit, but don't manage it there. See, you find your pickaxe. You do it like a proper miner with it. That's good. The lever opening the door out of here got buried in the collapse. You'll have to clear out a tunnel below us to get to it. So this is the bulk of the game is mining. Here we're just mining to get a pickaxe, but you know, you're mining for resources. There's that little gear over there, a little heart that'll heal you up. These ones are down here, they'll give you more light. You do need light. There are some lamps around here in the early game. The later game, it gets very, very dark and you'll probably get lost and stuck if you're not careful. Currently low grade pickaxe, can only mine this stuff to rock. Ah, there we go, it's over there. There we go. And you can jump at walls to get out, which is pretty handy. So let's go follow Dorothy and see where this takes us. Okay. You handle that mine like a real pro. Seeing as you're the new owner and all, maybe you should keep it open. Bring me in the door you find back up to me and I'll give you a fair rate for it. Mm. I wonder why this guy agrees to it. He clearly is not up for the idea of owning a mine. But there you go. This town sure can use it. Mm -hmm. I'm Dorothy, by the way. I hadn't guessed. Now, why don't you try mining some precious stones? Alright, let's go get us some ore and stones and. You do gotta be careful with how you're doing this game, it's very easy to leave some kind of ore out of your reach. And you also gotta be mindful of how you're gonna get back out again. So yeah, make sure you can actually climb out again, don't be mining every little rock or 
You're gonna have a bad time, buddy. Yeah, can't mind while jumping. Tried. I tried. Ah! You gotta mind out for these little critters, though they will reward you with um, fuel for your lamp and health if you can be them. Which is always handy. Especially when you're getting a bit later game, deeper down in the mines, you know, you'll frequently be r running out of fuel for your lamp before you even get back to the surface. Very frequently. It is something you do have to be mindful for. Looks like you're getting the hang of it. You should go see my daddy at the upgrade shop. Ooh, he'll fix that pickaxe so you can dig even deeper. Will I dig too deep? Let's just get that joke out of the way. No need to tell me you saw me down there earlier though. Don't go down there then. Gosh. Sharp pickaxe, excellent. So let's go talk to Cranky. Now I got something to work with. While you have them, I'll sharpen that pickaxe for you. It'll let you dig in hard soil. Sweet, I'll go for that. It's only eight gold. Yeah. Click the wrong thing. Top of the morning. Ah, you're Irish. I'll sharpen that pickaxe for you. Yep. I already read that book. There we go. That pickaxe should let you take on harder dirt. When I was scavenging for it, I found something else too. A Ooh, a cave. You might want to check it out. Joe used to bring all sorts of stuff down there. Be careful though. Critters have been a bit feisty since around the time you went missing. I've, I've noticed. Yeah. Yeah. The little bug things attacking me. I wonder what they are. I wonder if they're based on something real. I'm not sure. Ah, no shit about bugs. Oh god damn it. Yeah, I'm gonna run into this issue very quick. My inventory is full. Already. God damn that citrine. Citrine is the bane of my life in this game. God damn it. Come on little man. You can do it little man. I will say the controls much easier in in my opinion on um the gamepad as opposed to keyboard. For this game, but well, you know, your, your opinion may vary on that. Oh, what we got here? A copper pickaxe, excellent. Let's have us one of them. Alright, let's get to it and let's find this cave. I'm probably going to skip a little and I'll be back with you if something interesting happens or if we get to that cave. And what do we have here? It's the cave! Oh, what do we have here? So caves, they usually have some pretty neat stuff in. I won't spoil the surprise for you. Let's have a look. Nope. Well, of course, yeah. Why should we screw that up? Right, let's try and not die. Excellent. Now, uh, up or down? Uh, I think we'll go down first. Oh. Oh, what's this? Oh. Speed boots. I've got the speed. Oh. Oh, More sweet or citrine, excellent. Anything else interesting around here? No, I see those you can only dig from one direction. The crack indicates the direction. Nope, come on. Yeah, no, that's not that's not shift. Come on, 
You can do it. It's not that hard. Up we go. And uh, there's something else cool you can do. Running and jumping. Get you all those high, high to, hard to reach places. Yeah. Nope. No, can't reach. No. 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 Not gonna get that. Now there's that little bit on there. Let's go check that. Come on. Come on. Ah, no. Oh, god damn it. Come on, Dorian, get it together. It's not that hard. Just a few jumps. No. God damn it. Come on. Last chance. That's it, that's it. Yeah. Go. Yes, did it. Excellent. Oh, what's that over there? I'm not gonna be able to get that now, am I? Gosh darn it. <sighs> you have to be kidding me. Screw it. I'll come back for another time. I can't even mind this now, so I'll be coming back in all the time anyway. I'm not getting that citrine now. Fuck that citrine. But I did it. I did the cave, we got speed boots. And I'll proceed to probably never use them. Because why would I? Why would I make something that makes my life... Why would I use something that makes my life easier? So you found one of James Caves, did you? Oh, you see Mappy. I don't know that, that unnatural stuff he was up to down there. Cogs and steam, that I get. He meddled with some weird things he did. Sometimes I let him stack some of it here in my store. Glowing weird stuff. All weird glowing stuff. That's what he actually said. I'd rather see it, store it down there. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. A medium pouch. Sweet. I like that. Unfortunately, I even know how to place stuff like torches and ladders on the uh, PS4 version, which is really going to be a problem later on when I start running out of lights. I'll have to look that up. See, I looked in the key bindings, and there's very few. He minds you can actually set, so I can't work out what it's meant to be for the lamps and placing stuff. Sure, I'll find out eventually. Ooh, looky here, under the cave! Then we'll probably just go pick a few more or sell that, and then we'll go investigate. Ah! Back, foul beasts! Back! You'll not get me. Ooh! Bronze pickaxe. Don't mind if I do. Thank you, my man. And here we go. Let's have a look see at this little cave here. Mm-hmm. Aha. Uh -huh. 
No. Alright, okay. Warning we'll jump. We can do this. And. Yeah. It's alright, it's alright. We'll give it another go. Come on, let's do this. Oh, no. Come on. Oh no, it's almost there. I get the feeling this might not be possible right now because of the water. Now there is an upgrade with water later on in the game. So, also given the map is pointing me somewhere else, I'm thinking I have to come back here later. But you know, it was worth checking out, I suppose. So, let's get us some more ore. And find out what the arrow is pointing towards. This is a bit grindy, like, in the first parts of the game, but it does... There is some really good stuff later on. Just gotta get through the grind. There is some pretty sweet upgrades you can get. Uh, I've already completed this game um, once or twice on the PS4, pretty much in one setting. Uh, I really enjoyed it. And yeah, it's it's a good game. You just gotta get through this initial grind. And that's pretty much the only criticism I have of this game is it, there are a few bits that are a bit grindy. Other than that, it's it's a pretty sweet game. It's got a great art style. You know, the mechanics are fun. There's enough upgrades that it keeps it fresh throughout the whole game. And it, it's got a pretty cool story. The end of the, the end game is really cool. It's, it's an all-round solid game. I do recommend it if you've got the cash for it. Speaking of which, I will leave, like I said, links in the description if it's something you're interested in buying. And I do encourage you to buy it. It's a very good game. To get some ladders. I need to work out how to place ladders. I'm probably gonna die at some point soon. Oh, of course, I left them up there. Now, you do go mindful at this point, you get these little weak rocks, they will mess up all of your mining plans. Holy shit. myself killed by them one though. Please don't fall on my head, please. Ah, of course, just my luck. Um, my light's about to run out. No! I mean, lucky, um, in the early game, there are lamps, like, everywhere. Though, you know, later on in the game, this will really screw you over if you run out of light. It gets very hard to navigate. Come, uh, come on! This, this is not difficult, little man. This is not difficult at all. Just jump and shit. No, god damn it. Right, so I'm probably gonna leave this episode about here. I'm gonna go look up how I'm meant to play stuff. I'll sort out my gamepad so that I don't have to deal with trying to edit out all of my keyboard sounds. Try and find a working gamepad. Because I tragically broke my 
um, C3PA one, which came from my R2D2 Xbox. Breaks my heart to think about. So, yes, I'll leave it here for now. Hope you enjoyed it. Please buy this game and support the developers if you like it. And I will see you in another video. Bye.